right, to practice, we're going to look at four examples. Label the parts of the spindle apparatus below. What is the name of the structure on the centromere to which the spindle fibers attach? Starting out with this first part. Here I have a centrosome. Within it, what's really shown here is the centriole, but it's, it's, the centrioles are part of the centrosome. Remember that the centrosome is a microtubule organizing center, and within it, within each one, is two centrioles. Same thing on the other side. Radiating out in a star pattern is an aster. So there's an aster on this side and an aster on the other side. Here I have spindle fibers or spindle microtubules. These are composed of microtubules, um, hence the name. And these are attaching to the sister chromatids. This next part of the question asks me, What's the name of the structure to which the spindle fibers attach? So the centrosome is here in the middle, holding the sister chromatids together. And on the centrosome are two kinetochores. The spindle fibers attach one, the spindle fibers from one pole attach to one kinetochore. The spindle fibers from the other pole attach to the other kinetochore giving the setup that will allow the sister chromatids to be pulled apart. So the answer to this question is that the spindle fibers attach to the kinetochore. And the kinetochores are located on the centromere. Second example. 